we're here today at the Royal College of Art here in Battersea for the RCA Graduate Show, where all their blood, sweat and tears have gone into their final pieces and collections to be displayed for the world to see. So let's go and check them out. The show is very intense this year. I think there's a lot of work and clearly we're living in times where people are feeling quite uh, unsettled in. And I think that is uh, materialising as a certain, as I said, a certain kind of intensity in the way that people are working and dealing with the visual, dealing with engagement with the public. Um, all of those things, I think, are, are very sort of powerful. It's a very rich, dense, intense show. Well, I've got um, a few pieces on display here at the moment. So some large-scale porcelain pieces and some smaller-scale uh, porcelain and stoneware. Um, so I've been working with coloured clays and working with the clay when it's in its plastic state, so when it's most malleable, so where I can leave my mark on it. And um, I've been looking at repetitive mark making and obsessive surface pattern that really intrigues the viewer in. Uh, today is the opening of the degree at the Royal College of Art of the Jewellery and Metal graduates. Um, we see jewellery and metal really as a, a sort of quite a, a vast um, mix of things that go from design through to conceptual art, but really they're all person centric, so about the body and about the person. Um, throughout the show, you have themes like memory and narrative, uh, gender, education that sort of re reoccur and reappear. I'm quite interested in uh, notions of authorship, production, manufacture. Uh, so last summer I created a 3D printer from scratch um, which fluctuates simultaneously as an artwork and a tool. Uh, so it's something that's very important to my practice. I like to have it running during the show uh, so people can see the sort of mechanical reproduction of artworks or medical MRI scans. Um, and yeah, there's going to be a print printing for the duration of the show each day and then each new print is placed onto the shelves. Um, some of them are complete, some of them are incomplete, but it's kind of an ongoing process of manufacture and production. Well, we've got an amazing sort of variety of work. We have students working with video, we have performance work, and we've got, yeah, I mean, painters dealing with lots of different issues, political, uh, personal um, stuff about the world around them, really. So it's, and it's not a particular style, it's not you know, figurative or abstract or... It's kind of loads of different, different kind of ways of dealing with, with the ideas and the kind of interests of each student. We had a wonderful afternoon here and seen so many truly talented artists with inspirational pieces from ceramics and glassworks to ice sculptures, paintings, moulds, waxworks. We've seen so much here and it's really, really inspirational.